uh, Sean Holly took a trip to the House of Pain yesterday, where title chasing Pontypridd were playing host to arch rivals Cardiff. <laughs> Me bank holiday derby clash always guaranteed to bring in a big crowd. This is the last home game for Pontypridd this season, and they still have a chance of winning the league. They're lying in third place, four points behind leaders Merthyr. As for today's visitors, Cardiff, well, they're looking for their first win here since 2009. Bank holiday, expecting a big crowd here today. Yeah, we will. You know, I, look, it's Ponty Cardiff, isn't it? You know, I don't care if it's Ponty and Cardiff for touch rugby or tiddlywinks, you know, everybody what it builds up for that game. And as you can see, the sunshine is out and, and the family atmosphere is just building. Peter Thomas, uh, beautiful day for a derby match. Brings back old memories, I suppose. Fantastic. You know, I, it always takes me back to the time in the early, early to mid-90s. And I can see Nigel Walker running up this touchline. Fantastic days. And Cardiff Ponty are always special occasions. With the game scoreless in the middle of the first half, Tom Daly crossed over for Cardiff. Ponapreed <laughs> responded straight away with fullback Lloyd Rowland scoring. We found uh, some Cardiff fans and Cardiff Blue fans. Good to see you boys. Uh, enjoying the derby atmosphere? Oh, it's fantastic. Really, yeah, but Cardiff are doing really well today. Probably look the more threatening side. They've had some really good chances up there, a bit more accuracy and they'd been over. Tell us a little bit about um, how the Premiership has been for you this year. Good standard? It hasn't been too bad, to be honest. There was a lot of young players coming through. Uh, a lot of older players have done well as well. Um, I'm not sure, sure about the, the two-tier part of it, but um, yeah, so far it seems to be quite good. Now for our viewers who want to watch a lot of the Welsh Premiership, tell us uh, what's good about it. For me, what's good about the Premiership is, you know, you'll get a team who may be top of the league, first, second. They play on their off day, maybe away from home. Team towards the bottom can have a scalp. You're going away to Bargoyd, likes to them. You've got to be on fire, you know, to uh, keep getting a winning ways. Earlier in the week, Pontypridd schools beat Llanelli to lift the Dua Shield. At half-time, the home crowd celebrated with the youngsters. Well, we're five minutes into the second half here at Sardis Road. It's five all, and for a, a low-scoring game, a pretty entertaining one. With the game locked at eight all with ten minutes left, this happened. Once of Cardiff Blues, winger Geraint Walsh won the chase to score. It had a real feel of a derby, an old-school derby, a physical game too. Oh, there was no quarter given, was there, or asked. And you've got, you've got to give credit to the boys. It was hot out there, it was tough, and it was a really physical game. No keeps the title hopes alive. Need other results and a couple of away wins the rest of the season, but you're in there. Yeah, and that's what we want, really. I think we've got eight games, or seven or eight games that won't beat them, like, and it's just going on or building for next year. Like, So we're up there. Merthyr got to win their games remaining, so it's all on them, really.